Hello, and welcome back to AJM Learn. Today, I want to show you one of my all-time favorite things I've ever found is this Lightbox Anything plugin. So I'm on one of my client sites. So it's the best way to show you how I implemented this. Um, if you go, I've linked it all in the post. You can go to the plugins page, and they show you a demo. They show you actually a full installation demo, so you can get a full look at how it, you know, the process before you buy it. Um, but here's a kind of some insight. They'll give you a bunch of downloads, and basically you're going to up you're going to upload the Java as a link. You're going to upload the CSS as a link, which is pretty cool. You don't have to like manually put it anywhere. You're just uploading them as links, putting those under not linked. Um, I believe there's a slice of, of HTML you're going to drop in as well. I can't quite remember, but that's all, all in the instructions. Um, and then the coolest thing about this, so what I've done in this client site is this, this course's page is already very, very long, but she wanted more information. Let me go into full screen for each course. So I was like, okay, let's, figure out a way to do light boxes. So the coolest thing about this, so I'll go down here, they're all under not linked, I've just compacted them here, um, is you're building a full page for each one. And I think that's so awesome that you can completely customize it. You're not boxed into like, I've downloaded a ton of uh, plugins, tried a bunch of different things for light boxes and they look really weird. Um, they just never really look great. I love that you can just fully custom build a page. These I made these pretty simple because they are light boxes and I want them to be clean, but you can fully, fully customize these, which is so awesome. So let me jump back over to courses and show you kind of generally how it works. So pop into here. It's pretty simple. So I've actually created false buttons here because I'm, you know, using these text boxes. Uh, I do have a post on how to create this pill shape around some text. Uh, but basically the link itself, you're linking to the page. So as you just saw, I created all those pages. This one's called learning agility, learning dash agility. And this instructions are all in the plugin, but basically you're just adding this piece before. So you're linking to the page, but you're also adding this little hashtag lightbox underscore situation. And it's telling this link somehow in like magic code land to pop up as lightbox. Um, so it's pretty cool. So as you scroll down this page, any of these you click on pop up as light boxes. You can scroll in the light box. I've seen so many that are like stagnant, make the page look crazy. You can scroll right there in the light box. The one thing I did have to play around with was on each light box page itself. At first I was thinking, okay, like let me bring everything in like really tight like this because, oh yeah, this is a light box. Like let's make it all small. Um, I found it actually worked better kind of more full width. So that's one thing you might have to play around with. Um, but yeah, it works super seamlessly. I highly, highly recommend. The only regret I have is I bought a single license and I want to go back and buy the full license to where I can use it on more than one site. Um, hope this is helpful. I it, It's just amazing. So hope you like it.